Welcome back to another episode of Lazy Angler. I'm Mike, that's my loud kids in the background, and today we're going triple tail fishing with Shane and Nate, and we're gonna go ahead and try to put some on the table. Spoiler alert, we got one. We're gonna take this triple tail, we're gonna clean it, we're gonna cook it, we're gonna try out Land Shark Outdoors triple tail recipe from his video from a few months back, and we're gonna get right into it. Let's go. All right, so the first thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna run around, check buoys, uh, crab traps, floating styrofoam, anything that we can find floating in Tampa Bay around this time of year is gonna have a chance of holding triple tail. So a lot of people think, you know, let me check out that background. Let's see what bridge is there. Let's do all this stuff. Honestly, guys, doesn't matter. You can hit all the green and red buoys all the way starting at the Skyway, all the way up to Upper Tampa Bay, all the way to downtown Tampa. Every one of those spots gives you a shot at a triple tail. They do not live on these buoys. They do not stay there all the time. They sit, they eat, they move back and forth, yada, yada. You just got to put in the time. All right, so here's what we're doing. Two out circle hook shrimp tail hooked alive is better this thing's mostly dead oh go ahead got a little tiny split shot on there got our buoy right out there just flipping it got to be within five feet of that buoy we're gonna see if there's any fish home we're gonna catch about 700 catfish and a couple triple tail oh yeah got what the? Hook to hook. <laughs> That's like being nuts to butts. <laughs> <laughs> can you stop yanking so I can pull it to you and you can undo it? This is triple tail fishing. This is why there won't be a lot of footage. Catfish slime right there. See it? Oh, that's gross. Yeah. For all the people at home that think triple tail fishing looks fun, this is the truth. Right just the catch a buoy, catch your buddy, catch a buoy, catch your buddy. Two hours later. All right, we are on with our first triple tail finally after 38 catfish. Oh man, just got bigger. Haven't been recording much because of. How boring has been. Wait, I got that thing. 18, 19. Keep up. Oh, he's got a hook that he swallowed. This guy broke me off last week. How much you want to bet that's my same hook too? Yep, look at that. It's my owner. <laughs> and now you got a hook to fish with? No, uh, I mean, it's coming out of his shoot, poop shoot. This is the one that cut me off on this buoy last week. Hey, what did I just say? Last one I catch triple tails, a rotten egg. I'll take the rotten egg. Alright, well, fish number two was a heartbreaker. Oh, no way! No! I didn't even get the camera on him. Oh, I was over here grabbing the net. That was a good one too. He jumped twice. It's this cameraman sucks. Hey Shane, can you uh, let the people at home know what happened there? Well, this hook that I got tied on, I hate it with a passion. And it's not a very good hook, but as the hat says. We earn our nicknames around here. He's like, I hate this hook, it's stupid. It's the reason I lost that fish. And also give me a shrimp, I'm casting again. Can't help that Shane guy, he don't know how to fish. Terrible, terrible. Well, we were out here uh, last week, so the one that I just caught, 
had a hook hanging out of his butt. We went one for four that day. Oh, we got us a special guest, fish and angler for the Lazy Angler channel. Blake with a nice triple tail, 23 inches. We're back out here doing it again and uh, we'll do a little catch and cook later. There it is, get him. Don't be a catfish, that's very catfishy. Real, real catch up to him just in case. Cause triple tail will swim right at you. Yeah, triple tail, smooth. triple tail. Now smooth, right? hold on. Smooth, don't. Yep, no cause he's on. gonna run. Turn him the other way, he's he's small. I don't think he's gonna be 18, but camera, Mike, camera. it's on. I was actually recording for that hook set. Wait, 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 wait. yep, let him do it. Yeah, let yep. Him, him Aerial displays him. and I'm Mike, missing Mike, it again. Mike. Yeah, just guide him. That's all you're doing, tour guide. All right, let me get over here so I can get a little footage for you. It's 18. Bring him this way. Let's get a little shot of. They're here. Ooh, just, <laughs> yeah, this just came oh, out. <laughs> yep. Just hold, just hold the reel. I got you with this. Yep. We just gotta retighten that. Just, just loosen the drag a little bit, and you can just screw it in there. Or just bring him up because he's there. You don't even have to crank anymore. Wait, wait. Yep. Just hold it. Wait, wait. Mike. Yep. Got him. Go ahead. Here, hold up. Let's let's show what's happening over here now. Oh my gosh. This is how we just landed this fish. Now I think Shane did uh -huh. that preemptively because he was ticked off he missed his fish. Yeah, he was trying to make you lose your fish. You see that? He was, yeah. What the heck, Shane? Yeah. Squeeze him, pinch him there. Close. Pinch him. Have to do it up here. I wish we had our bump board. Oh, I guess you still got this hook in him anyway. Oh. No, I don't. No, he's he's yeah, he a little short. We gotta get a bigger one. It's fine. A little tiny bit short. That's all right. Get a picture. Oh, get yeah, a release. Right. Yeah, we're gonna get that. Right. We're good. Right. And then a good solid grip. Solid, Seventeen yep. and three quarters. All right, this is for our lazy angler long arming 101. Can you show the people at home how to make <laughs> yeah. an 18-inch oh, fish look, look 70? Oh! I'm actually eight feet tall as well. <laughs> there it is. There's the technique. You know, hide the hands, okay. get the elbow. Oh yeah, sweet. All right, All right get them, toss, lay them yeah. down, and get a go, buddy. Get an ass release. Yeah. Boom. <laughs> First triple tap on the back. That was fun. Sweet. <laughs> that was exciting. Dude. The reel falling off. While this Kobe is a great catch, they actually have to be 33 to the fork to be able to keep. So this one's going back. I got a little Kobe dog. Need a little bigger one. That's a beautiful fish. Release. I'm gonna go find Mama and bring her. Go tell her what I did to you so that she comes over here to yell at me. That's a good one. 328. Come on. Yeah. Yeah, that. That guy's pretty big. Yeah, he's a nice one. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, barely hooked. Don't lose. Oh my gosh. Points. 30 incher. Nice little We're 30 good. inch snook on the way out. Get him in here. Sea dogs. Points for the league. All right, we got to catch and cook with this little guy today. Triple tail. Trying out Land Shark Outdoors triple tail recipe. Look. Hey, what are you doing? Why are you so dirty? Look at your face. Why, why is your face so dirty? You playing with Anthony? Yes. You guys playing in the dirt? You having a fun time? Yes. Yeah? Okay. You're gonna keep going and playing and slide down the slide? Hey. Go ahead, play. Oh, come on. Uh, Yay! Uh, 
Yeah, that was fun? I'd say. <laughs> this is what happens when daddy's doing a catch and cook and mommy's at work. Sorry, babe. She's probably not watching this. We should be okay. So the trick with these guys is once you get inside there, just going over top of this rib cage. Because this is all pretty much useless. It's a very thin, thin strip of meat. And as you hear, Ray has got boogies, so guess I'm gonna be back to quiet mode and clean this up and I'll meet you guys inside. All right, so for today's cooking portion, we're gonna go over to a voiceover because uh, those kids were extremely loud. Um, they were pretty much in my face the entire time through the cleaning, um, cooking, all that good stuff. So we'll go ahead, voice over, and make it easier. Yeah. Can I put onions all over? Yeah. So in a large skillet, or two in my case since I didn't have a very large one, you're going to take your fillets, fill it up with tomatoes and onions. That's what the kids are helping me do right now. Then we're going to season it with some paprika some garlic powder, and don't forget the salt and pepper. I forgot it until I put it on the grill. We're gonna put a little bit of butter and some white wine to finish, and then we're gonna get it on the grill. All right, getting back up towards 450. It's about done right now. Looking good, looking good. Let's check the fish, see if it's cooked through. Oh yeah. That is soft, buttery even, you might say. All right, I think we're ready to eat. I'm gonna go ahead and get these off without burning myself, and uh, well, hopefully without burning myself, and get them into the kitchen and get us eating. Yeah, me too. Yeah, yeah. I'll tell you when that's enough. Yeah. That's enough. That's what you want too, Raya? That's enough. Yeah. Yes? Ooh. Are you stealing mommy's plate? Yeah. You want that? It's hot. Don't touch it. Hi. It's hot. Don't ask me why. Just listen. It's Hi. hot. Very good. Good? Hot. It's hot? Yes. Oh, yours is hot? You eating the same thing? Yes. This is mine. Oh, you're spinning it? Here, keep going. You spinning it for YouTube? Yep. Let them eat with their eyes. All right, how about you eat it and see if it's good? Careful, it's hot. Don't beat it to death. <laughs> I'll taste your fist. Now I'm gonna eat it on one. Okay. This guy's always the biggest fan, so we'll see. Good thing you got that fork so you can eat with your hands. <laughs> you chop your onion. Two hours later. But I didn't get any rice. Okay, is it good? <coughs> no? Oh, all right, well I'm gonna eat now. So you just tell the people at home whatever you got to say. It is very good and you should make it. Okay, what do you got to say? Yeah. Is it good? Yes? Do you love it? Oh, that was hot? And you dropped it? Yeah. Blow on it. You're so cute. <laughs> You're the cutest. Hot. Still hot? No, it's not. Eat it. Don't fake. Hot. It's not hot. Is it yummy? Yeah. Yeah, you like kissing tail? <laughs> Get a scoop and watch the drill. That is good though. Shout out to Victor and uh, Brooks family for the recipe. It's fantastic. We'll be making this again. How is it? Absolutely delicious. Spectacular. Can't complain at all. That's plate number two going down. Thanks for watching. Yeah. Comment down below what you should do next. And if you liked the video, subscribe. If you didn't, go away. Is that what we're supposed to say? You're supposed to tell them to go away? Time to get a life? No? All right, well, uh. Have a life. Have a, get a life. <laughs> Thanks for watching the jingle.
Click the circle on your screen to subscribe now, or click one of these two videos to go ahead and watch some more Lazy Angler. Leave a comment down below for a chance to be featured in next week's video. Thanks for watching.